you want to do a farm, you plant some stuff, you will first need to have some seed tokens. So to have a seed token, you will have to go to seed laboratory to create them. And also, if you're interested about what the farms are there, you can just kind of click on the farm board and the there are these farms. So what I'm aiming for is a Solvice USDC fund, and here's a 119% of the APR. So it means that how much I'm going to plant, I'm going to receive in a year, basically. Uh, and yeah, there are different uh, pairs of you can see. So let's actually get, if we, we want to get the farm, we just first need to head to this building right here. So, as you see, you, we have the laboratory and we just have to choose the one we want to create the peer. But if I choose the USDC right here, I have and I can actually create as much as seeds as I can, as I want. So let's actually go with the max. And I'm going to create the maximum tokens. So as you can see, the, the, the stats, if you're interested, you can see that there are 14 million Solrise tokens and 10 million USDCs in there. And current seed supply basically is 54 million uh, seeds of Solarize USDC. And also, you can see that uh, you can you will be able to see your seeds in this uh, uh, part as well. So let me actually just yeah choose the uh, again the USDC Solarize USDC. I'm gonna click on the max. I'm gonna just super easily go with that, and you're gonna be able to see that transaction is successful. You can go and just click on the link, and also you're gonna see the car gonna bring some assets in here right now. It's bringing the USDC and Solrise into the into this building, and here we go. I just got that another achievement because I created the seeds. So now I can see that I have my seeds. I can add more, or I can just remove them from here, just as much as I want. Let me actually just remove five, this much, just for an experimental thing. And as you guys see, it will be confirmed right now. Here you go. It's super fast. Like it just changes right now. So let me actually plant some stuff right now. You can ch like we have three different lanes right now. So you have Max has three different farms uh, at the same time to be visible. So let me actually just plant it here. So I'm gonna I have already planted this rope USDC farm uh, previously. So what I can do is I can choose that and they appear. So the rope right now rep it rep represents as a potato. So as you can see, it's uh, right here. If I click on that, I'm gonna see some stats that you can see I have total of this amount of seeds. I, the grown amount already is this much. And the grown speed is like this. Uh, if I want to add more, you can kind of click on that. If I had more seeds of the rope USDC farm, I, will, I would be able to kind of add more, but yeah, I don't have any of those. Uh, also, like if you want to kind of hide them, uh, like if you don't want it to sh show up, you can kind of hide this again. But also, if, if you want it to show up again, you can just go come here and choose the farm and you can see that it's here. And also, if you want to harvest, let's do a harvest. I'm going to go here and I'm going to harvest them. You're going to receive this cool, super fast notification from Phantom. And now, here you go. You can see that the, our tractor is uh, harvesting those and you can rotate it right now. Well, let me actually tell you about the controls as well. You can you can move around with the right click, you can uh, turn around with the scroll wheel and then just move the pointer. You can zoom in and zoom out for, with using the, the scroll wheel as well. And as you guys see, I just kind of harvested it. And here it is. So I have successfully harvested the crops uh, and they are again. So yeah, I got the achievement as well because I harvested my first crop. Let's go to the house building and see. So, as you see guys, I have the new achievement, I had the uh, harvest your first crops and my first yield achievement is done. Let's get back to the farms and let's plant our new Solrise USDC. So if you have many, many different seeds, you're gonna see the list here. So if you, if you just, I just have one, so here it is. So I can plant as much as I want, but I'm gonna go with the max. And I'm gonna plant it here. I'm just gonna super quickly approve the message and let's see how much time can I take. That's it. So right now we have our Durain farms, like it's just it's going to keep growing as well. So let's say if I want the Durain farm to uh, be here, I just go here, click on that. I'm going to choose another farm. I'm going to choose the Solrise farm and they swap the places basically. Or if I want to choose another different stuff that it's up to me basically and I'm going to just show it from there. Uh, and uh, yeah, let me actually just do a unplant as well, so you can kind of see that you can unplant some seeds. So you go uh, here, 
and you can just unplant as much as you want. Let me just go with the max and just get the rope token out of these thing. So yeah, it's gonna go there, and uh, it will just call that first harvest test the the amount of we had, and then get the seeds out as well. And that's how it actually works. Mm -hmm.